Hey, what's up? This is Keith with thejazzworld.com, and this is your two-minute holler for December 3rd. Earl Clues Weekend of Jazz is coming up once again. This time, it's at the Broadmoor in Colorado Springs, Colorado. Now, this is going to happen this spring. That's April 12th through the 14th of 2018. Now, the full lineup has not been announced just yet, but you know how they do it. All right. They have two night packages available, and that's going to include first class accommodations, tickets to the Friday and Saturday shows, a VIP artist experience, a 20% discount on golf green fees, and a lot more. So check out broadmoor.com slash weekend of jazz for Earl Clues Weekend of Jazz. Layla Hathaway just released her new album called Honestly, and if you haven't heard it, you're in for a treat. Now, she's going to go out on the road to support the album, and of course, it's called The Honestly Tour. Now, January 16th, she'll be in St. Louis. January 18th, Chicago. January 20th, Louisville, Kentucky. January 25th, Glenside, Pennsylvania. And February 7th, she'll be in Nashville, Tennessee. So be sure to check out thejazzworld.com. We have all the dates for Layla Hathaway, the Honestly Tour. I always like to keep you up on one of my favorite artists. That would be Kenny Babyface Edmonds. Now, he puts on a great show. And if you don't believe me, go ahead and YouTube or check out the MTV Unplugged that he did. Hey, great musicians great songs and you know he does that medley of songs that he wrote and produced for other artists you know the way it should be done all right well if you want to check him out live january 12th he'll be in inglewood new jersey january 19th and 20th washington dc february 16th he'll be in northfield ohio and february 17th he'll be in hammond indiana but like always, you can check out the entire concert schedule. Visit us here at thejazzworld.com. You know we got it going on for you. We're adding a new segment to the holla. It's called the Old School Jam of the Week. Now, this is not going to be popular songs that you hear every day on old school radio. I'm digging deep in the crates for these to make you say, man, I haven't heard this in about 15 or 20 years, all right? Well, let's start it off from 1986, RJ's latest arrival, Heaven in Your Arms. I got the link for you below. Go ahead and reminisce on that. Well, that's going to do it for us for this week. We'll see you next time.